Hello and welcome to Economy of Markets TV. I'm Dave Oakenquist, joined by Mr. Harry Dent. Harry, you are just about ready to go to Australia. I'm not sure if I, uh, I see you there, if you've got any, uh, any clothes there, or any suitcases. I don't know what you're bringing for a trip halfway across the world. I can't even imagine what, what goes into that kind of a trip, but I bet you're really excited to go there. You're going to be speaking there. Uh, one of the things you're going to talk about, Harry, is this special report uh, that came out uh, in December of last year. Uh, it's kind of a, a topic that you really like. It's something you've been hitting on. What is it? What is it all about? And uh, why are you talking about this today? Well, you know, yeah, we were just designing our presentation for our Australian audience. There. It's a very good audience there. Most of the people that have read my books uh, followed me for years. Um, and, and I was just thinking, you know, I, I wanted to share the same thing I had with, with our subscribers a while back, that, that in December in the leading edge, my flagship newsletter, I had done this special edition where I looked at how much progress has been made in the last 100, 120 years. I combined my research with Hans Rosling, which is another world scale researcher who died a few years ago uh, and is author of a new book called Factfulness, which his uh, son and daughter had to put out for him since he, since he died. But I was just like, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to tell this audience, you know, you got to share this with your friends. I mean, we are in this critical time. We got the greatest bubble ever, stock markets, highest levels ever, yet we've got this whole populist revolution around the world, and you've got, you know, our Trump could, you know, is up for impeachment, even though that probably won't actually happen, and there's no solution for Brexit. A lot of things we wrote about in Zero Hour, Andy Pancholi and I, and it's just like, okay, there's all this extreme stuff going on, but the backdrop is literally we've made more progress since 1900 in the last 100, 120 years than all of human history, thousands and thousands and thousands of years put together. My research and Hans Rosling shows this very clearly and I specifically designed that December version of Leading Edge in 2018 to be shared with your kids and grandkids. They're gonna appreciate the longer view better. They're gonna live that long. In fact, I'm saying in this report, they're probably gonna be live to be 100 plus, uh, while we're living to be 80 plus, much longer than our, uh, our descendants did. So, so it's, just, it's just a good time. And I thought, okay, I, I'm going to share this with all of my Australian attendees. And I have shared this, I think, once before, but I want to make sure everybody uh, on, on, on economy and markets knows this report you can download on our link in your, in your uh, email, and you can share this unlimited with anybody, but I especially say give it to your kids and grandkids. Hans Rosling, in fact, on this, had a 20-question test that world leaders, business, political, economists, everybody failed. Your kid does not have to fail this test if they just read this 20-page report. They'll learn more than they could learn from any economics professor in Yale or Harvard or any top program anywhere in the world. So again, download this, send this to people you know, but especially make sure your kids, uh, of like, I'd say high school or later age, read this report. Excellent, Harry. So it's not so people might think of you as a bit of a bear or at least in this time period what you're really seeing is uh the best is yet to come for humanity yeah yeah really this, we've just seen phase one we show in zero hour and this report how globalization had a big surge after world war ii well this is you know we're regressing and this is what happens things come in surges and now we're going to kind of regress in all these ways yes we're going to have this populist move we're going to have to restructure a lot of debt and, 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 you know, deleverage these bubbles around the world. And there is going to be a revolution. There needs to be a revolution because there's a better way to do everything. I call it the network revolution in all my books and publications. So this is what's going to be ushered in. And so then we go into this second stage. And, and what I'm saying is we've seen the first stage in our lifetime since World War II. Our kids and grandkids are going to see this second stage. And it's just going to be another you know, transcending everything in history. I mean, literally, I'm not kidding. More progress, life expectancy, standard of living, eight times just in the U.S. in the last hundred years, more progress than all of human history. We need to keep this in perspective because <laughs> things are a lot better than we think, given how kind of crazy things look in the near term. And, and they're going to get a lot crazier by our forecast. 
right? Uh, so it's a little bit of chaos the next couple of years, but the future is bright. Now, you wrote this in your uh, publication, Leading Edge, and in Leading Edge, you, you publish a, at least six issues every year. Talk a little bit about what's, what's different about Leading Edge than, say, what you write in Boom and Bust and uh, why people should sign up for that. Well, you know, yeah, it is what it says. It's the leading edge. We're not just looking at like in boom and bust. We look at, okay, what, what's happening now? What things might be of importance for investment or changes in political or investment trends or economic trends? Now, this is really looking at, I'm always looking at what are the new cycles? Oh, you know, I'm always learning. I mean, we, I just added, and I'm going to cover this in the January boom and bust in this case, a whole, you know, the money velocity indicator applied to emerging countries who are making the biggest investments in the future, and we can see how productive they are, and there's some big surprises there. So the, I'm always learning, and this is giving you the leading edge of the learning, and basically what leading edge is giving you is what most people are going to read in my books two, one to two years from now. So you're getting everything earlier, and you're getting the most important stuff now. Excellent. So as Harry said, we will have a link, a bit of a bonus for all of you to get that uh, single issue of Leading Edge as well. We also have a link if you're interested in, in following Harry, well, as he says, these Leading Edge topics ahead of what might come in Boom Bust or just stuff that we, Harry, we, sometimes we find things and we just take a little topic and run with it. Uh, that kind of a thing, that, that sort of uh, non-traditional, just it's, a, it's Harry Dent unfiltered essentially, whatever topics we're going at uh, that do, do end up trickling into Boom and Bust and, uh, and uh, your future books. So definitely check that out. Harry, I wish you a great trip. I hope everything goes well. I can't wait to hear back from you. For Harry Dent, I'm Dave Oakenquist, and this has been Economy and Markets TV. Okay.